You shouldn't have, Albie. I know your mother's got a sweet tooth. How have we got you then, did he? Check him out, old money bags. Well, I might have lent him my credit card. Yes, I would Oi, oi, oi. When was the last time you were on the brink of death pushing out a small human? Never. That's when. Mm. Well, then. Well, mate. Hey. Happy Mother's Day. Checking on Whitney. Oh, she's made her feelings perfectly clear. Zach, she's grieving. Her feelings are like a tornado. You need to be the steady one. Why? Why, why do I need to be the steady one? I'm grieving too, Sharon. I can't see me. Yeah, Look, I know it's hard for you as well, but her body's been through so much. You know, she needs patience and care. Yeah, that's exactly it. She's convinced I don't care. She thinks I'm relieved that I'm not tired to her no more. That's not true. No, I know that. So prove it to her. Are you sure you want to do this without Whitney? Yeah, it's her choice, not mine, isn't it? OK, um, well, thank you for being here. Really does mean a lot. I wanted to plant this tree as a way of remembering Peach. Um, I haven't really prepared anything to say, apart from thank you for being here. And uh, I didn't realise how much I wanted to, to be a dad until I suddenly wasn't anymore. And, uh, in a funny kind of way, even though I didn't get to meet her properly, she has, has changed me for the better. And I'll never forget her. So, thank you, Peach. And we're too late. Of course not. <laughs>